In this video, I will demonstrate how to enroll with the UReset password service and reset your own password whenever you want without calling the help desk. You are required to be enrolled in the service before you can start using it. You will receive enrollment reminders via email. The reminder may also appear in the system tray notification balloon tip. There may also be a shortcut to the enrollment page from the start menu. Following the links will bring you to the page here. To get started, you will need to confirm your username and enter your password. The enrollment process will vary for each user depending on the identity services aka forms of authentication configured by your organization. Your administrator may have pre-enrolled you in some identity services. Your enrollment information is marked green and can be found on the bottom of the screen. In my organization, I'm already enrolled with Duo Security, but I can also enroll with any of the identity services shown here. You will be reminded to enroll until enough identity services are collected to fill the star bar. I will also enroll with the fingerprint authenticator using my virtual phone to complete my authentication. The SpecOps fingerprint authenticator app allows you to authenticate to the SpecOps password reset service using either the Touch ID fingerprint recognition feature integrated into your iOS device or the fingerprint API scan feature integrated into your Android 6.0 Marshmallow operating system. The steps are straightforward. I simply scan the QR code and provide my fingerprint. My enrollment is now complete, but I can continue enrolling with more identity services. This way, I will have more identity services to authenticate with if I happen to forget my password. I think I'll enroll with mobile code. Again, the process is pretty straightforward. Simply provide your mobile number and you will receive a one-time code that you will be asked to provide on the screen. To enroll with any of the social or email identity services, provide the email address and password associated with your account. Rest assured that neither SpecOps or your employer will collect your, or store your username or password. The services might show a standard warning message stating that you are granting access to your information, but as already mentioned, no personal data will be revealed to the solution. You can now reset your own password whenever you want without calling the help desk. The password reset service can be accessed from the password reset link on your login screen or the SpecOps password reset app from your smartphone. The app is available in the Windows Store, App Store, and Google Play. Simply start the app on your device and follow the on-screen instructions. Let's return to the logon screen. Clicking the reset password link will launch the web service. The first step is providing your username. After this, you will be asked to verify your identity using the identity services in your enrollment. Select one identity service at a time and perform the corresponding authentication. The authentication process is complete when you have enrolled with enough identity services to fill the star bar. I need three stars to fill the star bar. I'll get one star if I authenticate with Facebook. Two more stars to go. Let's give mobile code a shot. I have successfully authenticated my identity and I'm taken to the new password page. As I enter my password, I can see in real time what rules I must meet. If the new password meets the complexity requirements, it will be accepted and I can start using it right away. And that's all there is to it. I can successfully reset my own password without calling the help desk.